Friday at the Sony Ericsson Championships saw Yelena Jankovic book her semi-final place. The Serbian defeated Caroline Wozniacki in straight sets. Jankovic dominated the match. It took her just 31 minutes to wrap up the first set. She was on her way after first securing a break in game five. Wozniacki came into this one on the back of a punishing win over Vera Zvonareva. The Dane did well to even finish that match. After spending nearly six hours on court in her first two matches, Wozniacki just had nothing left here. Jankovic recorded one further break on her way to an uncomplicated 6-2 first set. The one-way traffic continued in the second set. The world number eight soon had her nose in front, with Wozniacki struggling to stay in rallies and offering very little on her own serve. Jankovic was able to break to 15 in the opening game. Wozniacki had completely run out of steam by the time Jankovic broke again in game seven. The Serbian was to make no mistake in serving out the match 6-2, 6-2. A disappointing display for Wozniacki, but understandable given the torrid time she's endured in Doha. The Dane was left to wait for the result of the Azarenka Radvanska match to see if she made the semis. Svetlana Kuznetsova was playing only for pride against Elena Domencheva, but she showed no mercy against her compatriot, dumping her fellow Russian out of the competition. Domencheva looked nervous right from the off. She found herself on the defensive very early on, serving break points as Kuznetsova started by far the brighter of the two players. Domencheva was punished for her hesitant start in game six. Two double faults helped Kuznetsova secure the key break. It was all downhill after that for the world number three. She secured a 6-3 set with a minimum of fuss. The second set went no better for Dementia, for whom the errors slowly increased. Even her usually reliable backhand deserted her as Kuznetsova broke in the opening game. Another break arrived in game five. By this time, Dementia was well beaten and knew it. The Russian didn't even bother to challenge when this forehand flew only marginally long. Kuznetsova confirmed victory with an ace. 6-3, 6-2 was the final score. A result that sends Venus Williams into the semi-finals. In Friday's final game, disaster struck for Victoria Azarenka. Injury forced her retirement against Agnieszka Radvanska and brought about an end to the Belarusians' tournament. It had started well for Azarenka, who after an early exchange of breaks edged ahead in Game 5. Radvanska, who of course came into this tournament as second alternate, played an inconsistent first set. She went to double break behind at 5-2 before immediately pulling one back. It wasn't enough. Azarenka served out the set 6-4. The number six seed looked like running away with it in the second set when another double break saw her race into a four-love lead. But what should have been the final straw for Advanska turned out to be the catalyst for an extraordinary comeback. The pole benefited from four breaks from the next five games. Three were in her favour. In game 10, a nervous Azarenka surrendered her serve to 15 to tie the match at 5 all. Azarenka had looked to be cruising into the semi-finals, but suddenly the momentum was very much with Radvanska. She broke again in game 12 to level the match at one set all. No one will have been more delighted than the onlooking Caroline Wozniacki, whose tournament future depended on a Radvanska win. But the turning point in this match was an unexpected one. Radvanska had just held in the opening game of set three when Azarenka called for the trainer. Like Wozniacki yesterday, she became the latest player to go down with severe cramp. The 20-year-old, who was playing in her first ever Sony Ericsson Championships, somehow managed to battle on for the next five games, but ultimately it proved too much for the Belarusian. Doha saw another tearful withdrawal as Azarenka was forced to retire at 4-1 down in the decider. That means a place in the semis for Caroline Wozniacki. She'll face Serena Williams. Elena Jankovic, meanwhile, 
has a semi-final date with Venus.